Mukwen leads a cross in here now. It's a great one. And a defensive header from Fabian McCarthy. Needed to get that right. He's been on the score sheet. He doesn't want to get on the score sheet at the wrong end. And that was definitely one of the possibilities now with that header. A risky one. But hey, you have to be brave. And he wasn't too sure what's happening behind him. He's been around there as Fabian McCarthy, very experienced. So he did the right thing by playing the ball where he was facing. Vivian French floats it in. The header! 2-0! Would you believe it? It's Fabian McCarthy! Now, you tell me, where was the defense? Almost like in slow motion, he rises. Nobody around him. And obviously gets all the power behind the ball and leaves Brian with not a chance at all. Take a look at it again. Franz going to the far post. Look at that. He attacks the ball. The marker, Sianda Kulu, doesn't pick him up. Have a look. See Kulu there standing left, standing by himself. Take a look at this again. No, you won't see Kulu out of your picture there. He was literally ball wide. Away from McCarthy. Jalen. Jolly now. Headed away from McCarthy again. That was a deep striking position. And as a junior seems to be uh, doing up his bootlaces. Around Fabian McCarthy. Lots of instructions being given there by Tobo Moke as to where he wanted the ball positioned. McCarthy again, formerly with the Bloomfontein Celtic, also played here with the Namalodi Sundowns. This is Matabula. Mushekwi, what a powerful man he is. Can't get past Fabian McCarthy, that's why McCarthy is in the side to deal with the power of uh, uh, Mushekwi. For his twin brother Matthew Booth. Side, little touch from McCarthy. It's a good fall for Twitter. He's decided to take the throw in. He's timed it. His head is very nice. This McCarthy's won most of them just because of his good sense of positioning. The experience of a man with more than 300 league and cup appearances, Fabian McCarthy. Once again, flirting with offside, but the flag stayed down. Chancer was in there, but so was the head of McCarthy. So even the center line, they are a team that is under pressure, Lo lots of pressure. Now they're going, yes, Mary. Well, you know what they say, you must never admit guilt. Mokwena trying to thread it through, oh, miscue from Peterson, but McCarthy is there to cover for him. That word very liberally and uh, in italics. I should say the so-called big four, perhaps. Booth lets it go for Dominguez. Trying to throw the ball through for Mushiki, who was... So it's uh, building up to be an impressive run here for... It's on a very good uh, defensive display by Maddisburg United. They've been well organized defensively and uh, full value, really, for keeping uh, a clean sheet. But Sundowns haven't stopped trying, but try and try as they might. Crosses with a left foot, it might fall out for Happy Jelly. He was trying to place the ball and got blocked by McCarthy. Jolly's waiting, shot. Stated Mashef will be cleared away by McCarthy. Cross over the head of Mashef cleared away by McCarthy. It's a throw in against him. Another long throw. Looking for Buyane away from McCarthy. As can do as we approach half time. Chancer goes for goal. Header away from McCarthy again. He'll be feeling the sting of all of those uh, balls off his head. Look at him rubbing there. Scored in the next seven minutes. That's uh, what the research has shown, and he has an opportunity which is going to be denied. Good clearance by Fabian McCarthy. Lovely approach away by Kakana. That's his job. Break up attacks like he did there. Remolandi with the test up of McCarthy. And again, solid stuff from Fabian McCarthy. A 
Matthew Jenner goes on the run forward. He's going to draw this back here for Chancer. And McCarthy up to Maleka. For Kwani. And uh, there's a goal of tour, which uh, Black Leopards uh, won eventually that encounter. Charity match on penalties. So, uh, tee up something here. And there's a little tip over the top. Great effort here. Net shot Just a little touch on him from Totetti. The referee will give the throw in. Baby McCarthy standing his ground as well. Amazing thing. A lot cooler now today already. You can see the effects already. Rompo Kikana. Fisher Contore. Megan McCarthy, well positioned. Now it's turbo for Black Leopards, but they go through the middle of the park looking for Clamini. But at the moment, sensing they can do to Chiefs what they did to Sundowns at this very. Plenty of targets to aim for. Cross is not the best one at all. Easy to defend those. And Chiefs can bring it upfield again. Yes, that's a good ball. Moya Modise goes wide, needs some help from Shenzelani behind him. Might well use him, yeah. No, he's going to try and do it on his own. And he's not going to be three men. And here he gets a little touch there. McCarthy will clear. And Spellman looks to keep. But I think they need a little bit more than that if they're going to really dominate. So he slow down the momentum of the side who uh, toppled a lot early in this. So arrows down to 10 men for the time being. Fabian McCarthy. Looking good, I must say, Fabian. Chance for Arrows maybe to break on the counter attack here. And uh, good defending done by Fabian McCarthy. Mahamutsa forward. Malakasi tracking back. McCarthy also comes from Bloemfontein. With the last touch. The unavailable Nyatama. Still only he played the first time ball towards uh, Matong, but Matong and his back to his teammates, and the pass wasn't strong enough anyway. To it. Well, it is about adjusting, and uh, David McCarthy really showed all of his, his experience. Goes into space, but uh, really. Mukwena. Kenyeza. Goes down. Referee gives nothing. We into the last minute of time added on now. Surely now, Marysburg United are in the semi-finals of the Telcom knockout. As they try to pick out Fajr Davids.